Yo guys, it's Zaluto back with another video and this is tutorial for how to make epic thumbnails so let's get started so first of all open new worksheet from file menu of 1280 pixels into 720 pixels so you can see 1280 pixels into 720 pixels thumbnail size ok press ok So what you have to do is now select an image or any your design on which you make thumbnail which is your main thing of your video. So I'm choosing a banner template or a banner image for my video which is main part of my video that so now select middle part of it or banner part of it rest delete. And now what we have to do is find an appropriate image related to that concept of the video and use it in the background so I want to search on warfare image because my concept is war I'll search for war wallpaper instead I will search for god war wallpaper which will, which will look nice okay this image is appropriate now save it Now set its position and now try to cut the couple of roots with the help of pen tool. It will take time. Now when you will complete it, then take that Im render image above that banner image and this will look awesome and now for further editing of the thumbnail I recommend Supreme 50k pack of Steven to be downloaded now place that image at the other side of the wallpaper and set its temperature and who and saturation so it can be mingled with that whole concept now time for color corrections cc and brightness to arene and contrast 52 and it's almost looking nice now we'll go with vibrance okay so and we'll increase a little bit of vibrance and saturation and now we'll color balance, do color balance and reddish and now in the favor of green and then yellow and it's looking very very awesome now what we have to do is now have we have to open the text option and write the title of that image or title of the thumbnail which is warfare banner so first of all I'll write warfare with black text so it's just very nice and font is also appropriate and now we'll write banner so we'll set that cap capital letters at first and so it can look nice and I want to change that NN to capital and so the dots disappear which were not looking good okay now i'll change the color of banner text in the to the the color mustard shade which is re related to that whole image and whole concept and this is looking nice okay so now under the shishis and now most important thing the lightning so what we have to do is with brush take your brush and cover the sides of your image with black color and the top of the image with white color and it will look really really very dope and afterwards you have to decrease or increase 
Opacity. To increase the size of text because that text of warfare banner because the upper part of thumbnail is looking very empty so let's increase the size by transforming control plus T okay Time to put some JFX from that Supreme 50k graphics pack. So I'll add some smoke at the under of under the thumbnail. It's looking very very dope. So now we'll give it yellowish and reddish effects so that it can match with that image. So it is looking nice. Opacity is appropriate. Now we'll give effects to the heading, warfare banner, so first gradient overlay then inner glow, dark inner glow and gradient overlay opacity very low. So now press ok, it is looking nice. Now time for banner, text and same thing gradient overlay and overlay of blending mode overlay and decrease the opacity and inner glow. So I don't think that it needs any glow so let's put drop shadow and that that's looking nice and little bit of spread and little bit of size and that's looking nice now same as that previous text and okay a little bit of spread and this is and this is okay Oh, I forgot darkening the lower part of thumbnail. It's okay, I'll do it now. Okay, and this is looking okay. Opacity to 40%. Okay, so this is looking now. It's looking nice.
But still, I'm not satisfied with that layer style of banner text, so I'm changing it. And okay, now I'll try to give it a mustard shade by giving a yellow shade. Oh, sorry, I forgot to convert it into smart object. Now we'll take to give it first yellowish look, then we'll decrease the vibrance. So. I think we have to go for color balance now okay color balance yellow a little bit of green and then blue no I think red some bit of red okay but still it's not a mustard shade so let's why not decrease it mm. oh now it's looking nice and that's our final product, final thumbnail.